Coming up on CodeWire, the city wants you to know about the dangers of carbon monoxide poisoning. Stay tuned to learn about how you can protect yourself and your loved ones. Next, spring is coming up and Code has a few spring cleaning tips. Then, South by Southwest is approaching. Have you registered your short-term rental? We'll tell you how. And finally, Austin now requires you to register your boat dock, but the reason may surprise you. In 2019, the Austin Code Department and the Austin Fire Department are teaming up to inform everyone about the dangers of carbon monoxide poisoning. Over 10,000 injuries happen each year, so the city is reminding you to make sure you have a working smoke alarm and a carbon monoxide detector in your home or apartment. You can test them out each year by pressing the test button and make sure the batteries are working. Check out our other videos on our YouTube channel to learn more. The spring season is coming up and Austin Code is here to remind you that a clean city starts at home, so make sure to trim off any damaged branches from your trees. Place your yard trimmings at the curb by 6.30 a.m. on your collection day and throw away any signage lying around your property. Learn more spring cleaning tips on the Austin Code's Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram pages. South by Southwest is coming up, so don't forget to apply or renew your STR operating license. This includes all properties, including rooms and guest houses, rented for less than 30 consecutive days. All owners who don't include their license numbers are breaking the law. Visit www.austintexas.gov code. Did you know that you are required to register your boat dock in Austin? In the event of an emergency, first responders will need to know the address of your boat dock. You can get started by visiting www austintexasgovernor slash boat docs. That's it for this edition of CodeWire. Tune in next time to learn more about what's happening in Austin. Thanks for watching.